Hey guys, and welcome back to my Minecraft Creation World. Now, I know it's been around over a month since our last episode, like a month and two days. Since our last episode, because the last episode I made was literally for the Valentine's Day party on uh, February 15th. Because I made the video like the day after Valentine's Day. But hey, this time I got it up on the correct day for St. Patrick's Day. Yay! And yes, still offline. Uh, this, that better get resolved soon. But hey, I'll still deal with it. Hey, at least I was able to decorate this world. That's all that matters. So, here we go. St. Patrick's Day 2020, March 17th, and will end on the 22nd. So guys, um, here we go. Uh, actually, our first friend is actually right here. The St. Patrick's Day 2020 hat, let's pick that up. There we go, that's how it looks. Looks nice, right? You know, it's kind of funny because I still have to do this all on Legos Island. Oh man. Oh, also side warning for the Legos Island St. Patrick's Day party. I'm unfortunately regretful to announce that it's not going to be as big as last year. Just because last year's took way too long to create. So to prevent the amount of time that it takes for me to create that, I'm not going to put in as much stuff this year for that, but I'm still going to add in a lot of items. And don't worry, plenty of decorations, it's just, I don't know if I'll be decorating the entire island this year. Oh, we'll just have to see what happens. I'll let you guys know how much I do. But just, again, warning, it's not going to be as big as last year. Just because it took way too long for me to do last year. And I'm not even joking, it actually took so long last year to do it. Anyway, um, thanks to this world being pretty small... I did it only took me maybe like three hours. So yeah. Oh, actually, uh, we should go up here. Uh, actually, we can head over here really quick because I want to actually change it to daytime. Uh, let's go in here. There we go. Yeah, we're just changing it to daytime. Also, as you can probably notice, none of these rooms are decorated, actually. Yup, none. So, um, alright, so now that it's daytime, you can see this better. So anyway, as you guys can see, yes, there's the free item right there. There's like three items in this event, like three, literally. So, see, so, yep, there's a bunch of gold and also a brand new custom feature. I'm actually gonna add this on Legos Island as well for a new custom feature. Um, there are also these emerald things too. Also, I did change up the gold a little bit. I'm not going to do that on Legos Island, I'm just going to bring it back to the way it normally is. You know how it's like this, the emeralds? It's just going to be like that, but just gold, just how you saw it last year. The emerald things will be brand new. Yeah, I'm so mad to think on Legos Island, that's going to be great. Um, Alright, here we go. So, yep, there are a bunch of these all over. Uh, so, yeah, what do you guys think? Doesn't it look cool? I know, I definitely think it looks nice. Anyway, um, yeah, let's stop going down here. Let's actually just head up here. Hold on. Uh, let's, uh, clear this first by inventory. Right, that's the banner, by the way. Alright, go up here to, uh, oh, uh, right here, the treehouse. It may not seem like much up here. Although, you'll see a difference. Actually, yep, yeah, right there. You will literally see a difference. It's right there. The, uh, the glass looks different. And not to mention here and here. And also all down there. Yep, that's all different. You probably might have noticed that. Probably at the beginning of the video. 
Uh, yep. You take a look at this. It looks nice, right? Beautiful. In here also looks nice. Let's take a look. There it is. Also, these look cool too, right? Um, oh, and here too. Now, in here, you'll love this. There we go, look! Yeah, it may not look like it too much, but hey, this room is small. So what can you expect? I can't go crazy like my cave on Legos Island. So... Yep, so this is literally how the room looks. I'm not even joking for uh, this room. Looks nice, right? With the carpet, the windows, and just the beds too. That all looks really nice. Alright, now we're gonna move on to, uh, we're gonna move on to right here. I guess more emeralds. And more gold. We'll get to that in just a minute. And yes, more emeralds right there. And here I tried to make a shamrock. Obviously that failed. Alright, I'm back, so I just had to do some, but anyway. Uh, I know, I kind of failed to make this. <laughs> And right before I made this, I realized that the little heart on the floor was still there, so I obviously removed it. So, yeah, what do you guys think? Here are the windows in here. Those look nice, don't they? Well, upstairs looks a little better, but I can't guarantee you. Yep, look at that. Look, you can even see the little cruise ship in the background. By the way, I actually did make a small update to it. I'll show you that later. Like, I did make, like, a really small update to it. And I might just update it again while filming. And here, as you can see, I updated the windows there. I also updated the windows right there. And I also updated the window right there. Yep, nothing back here. So, yep, that's cool, right? Alright, uh, <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. And over here, here's the pet cemetery pool, of course. Here's how it looks for St. Patrick's Day. Yeah, what do you guys think? It looks really nice, right? Uh, that's literally how I decorated for St. Patrick's Day. It looks nice, right? And here's how it looks when you're underwater. I know, doesn't it look so cool? I know, I think it does. So, yeah. Now actually, I can show you the small update from here, from the small cruise ship. You probably might notice a really huge difference. You remember how there used to be dirt right here? You know, uh, this on top? Well, I removed it to make it look like it's actually floating on the water. How smart am I for that? I know, how clever am I for that? Yeah, because before it was just on dirt and not on the actual water. So again, I changed it to make it look like it was actually floating on the water. Now, I might actually change this too to also make it water, so it can make like the entire thing is water and not just grass just laying here. Yeah, I'm probably going to change that. Actually, why don't you comment down below if I should actually change like this grass right here? The ones that you can see still here right in front of the fence. Um, comment down below if I should change that to water too. Because I feel like it would be a little better, but you guys decide in the comments on this video. All right, let's uh, get out of here and uh, move on. All right, now we're gonna move on to the village. Uh, actually, um, Actually, um, the third item of this event is at the village, so you know what, we're gonna save that for last, actually. Yeah, we're gonna save that for last, because the second item is right over there in the creation, in the, 
action world series. So why don't we head over there first, so then I can save the village for last, where the last guy is. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Yep, the uh, action world series. Yep, more emeralds right here. Yeah, I'm definitely putting those for Lego's Island. Yo, what do you guys think of this little uh, setup? I know, doesn't it look nice? I know, it looks beautiful. Yep, we got more gold right here. More emeralds. Yeah, I'm definitely adding these for Lego's Island. So yeah, that's how it looks. Now, if we go inside, the only difference on this room are the windows. Oh, and actually, it's a good thing that it is nighttime and also that I'm in the cabin because then I can just put them to sleep. Uh, let's climb on the top one. There we go. I kind of like the top one more than the bottom one. There we go. <laughs> and then it's funny how we literally land on the floor as soon as we get out of there. Obviously, because, you know, there's no platform up here. And that's how it was in the original creation. And yes, also, did you notice there was an emerald here, too? We have also to see the windows here, as you can see. Um, they are also been changed, too. So, uh, next up, uh, is the hotel. Before we go in, though, take a look at the windows. Yeah, look at those beautiful windows. All right, let's go inside. And this is where everything gets crazy. Look at it in here. It looks nice, doesn't it? Yep. Also, I did change the little desk. So that's why you can probably see that. I changed the carpet, of course. And obviously the windows. It looks really nice in here, right? Oh, trust me, up there is honestly a lot better. Yeah, what do you guys think? And, um, yeah, let's head upstairs. And, uh, here's what it looks like from the elevator. There we go. First off, we head in here. The only difference is that. Next up, if we go into the first room, as you can see, just look how cool it looks. I know, right? It looks so cool. Obviously, there's the windows there again. Yep. So yeah. And the other room. Take a look. Yep. There it is. So yep, yeah, that's the other side of the room. Looks nice from here, right? Yeah, you can probably see a lot of the village from here. Alright, let's head back down the elevator. Alright, we can get out of here. Also, I do need to finally do something for this eventually. You know, if I don't forget about it. Eh, don't worry, I won't. I'll obviously do something to it in the future. I always update things that have not been updated yet in like the near future a lot of times. Anyway, there's more emeralds and gold here. So yeah. Oh, frick! Do you know what I totally forgot to do before starting to film this video? Oh, come on, guys. I'm pretty sure you can see what's missing up here. Oh, it's the luck icon. Hey, actually, speaking of luck, we can actually get it right here. This is our second free item. Potion of Luck. And there we go. There it is. Yep. Yep, that proves that we can get it. See? Now we have Potion of Luck. There you go. That's why we didn't have it at the beginning. Um, there is um, a lot of stuff around here. Not to mention that that's there too. Alright, we can uh, get out of here now. And uh, now we can head over to the village. I, I 
honestly liked following the path, let's be honest. I actually like following this path. I mean, what's the point of the path being here if you don't follow it? Yeah, if you don't follow the path, what's even the point of it being here? You're kind of supposed to follow the path to get to each place, but technically you can still go around on the grass, of course. Now we go to the village. For real this time. I'm actually serious, for real. We go to the village now. More emeralds here, more gold. Yep, you can still see the amazing cruise ship that we built over a month ago. Yeah. Anyway, more emeralds here. And just a lot here. There's like so much. I'll get into the insides in just a second, but here's the outside of the village. I know, doesn't it look so cool? Yep, yeah, this is the outside of the village. But trust me, the insides are honestly even crazier. First off, the lighthouse. Look at this! It's nice! Oh, trust me, it looks pretty crazy on the inside. And let's get to that now, actually. Uh, wait! You probably noticed something. There's the last item. The St. Patrick's Day 2020 banner. You can pick that up. And here's how the banner looks. But actually, here's how it looks in full reality. Yep. That's how it looks. Alright, we're gonna go into the first house. Obviously. Alright, so yep, as you can see in here, the windows are updated alongside the beds. Kind of exactly the same way we did it for the Valentine's Day party. Ah, uh, I probably shouldn't have not put the banner in my hand because now I'm going to keep doing that. Oh well. Next up, this house. Yep, all that's changed is the windows and the bed. You know, I might actually just have to hold the potion because I won't keep placing the banner whenever I, you know have it there. Anyway. Uh, whoa! It looks like that got left open. Yeah, I'll close it one after we go through it. Uh, our next house is right here. Going in here, all there is is the windows updated again. And, of course, the bed. Next up, the library. There are actually quite a few differences. Number one, the windows are updated. Two, the little tables are updated too. And also the little desks. So, that's uh, quite a few differences. I mean, like, literally for once we finally get a difference in here. When this library is rather small. Yeah, honestly, I'm, I'm honestly glad I put it right there because honestly it makes it a little more hidden and a little bit harder to find. Next up, we're gonna go to the lighthouse. Actually, we should save that for last. Yeah, we'll save that for last. All that's in here is the windows are updated. That's it. Although, don't worry, there's some golden emeralds right beside it. No, I should actually add some, like, right here. There we go! That looks even cooler. No, it would be a little harder to get around, but anyway. Now we can head over to the lighthouse, which, if you probably might notice, obviously has all the windows updated, of course. But of course, like I've been saying all this time, the inside is even better. Check it out.
Yep, just look at the inside. Doesn't it look so cool? And even on the outside. There we go. And uh, that's also what's on top. Well, <laughs> that's it. Alright, now our last place. Right over here. For the entire event, actually. Quite literally. Is the work shed. Take a look. Looks nice, right? Really? Inside's better. Yep, just look how cool it is in here. So, uh, the last room is in here. Yep, and, uh, that's quite literally it. I think that's all I did. Oh, come on. You know, I guess I could have placed banners around here, but... You know, that's actually not a bad idea. Let's actually go ahead and place some banners. And I would actually make this place look really good. Now, why did I not do that all this time? Okay, I think that's enough for the banners. Anyway, uh, I think that's actually it. So, uh, yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! You probably might have just noticed yet another big difference. This wasn't here before this path. I also put this in. Right before recording, too. So it says, people of the series, fair anniversary setup. That's because that's what we created back in September, on September 4th. So, we can still enjoy it. Now we actually get a full-on way to actually get here. Instead of having to just fly over to this place. Nope. You can actually now, um, go over to this place, um, if you were to just connect to each place. Now, so yep, now this place is fully connected over to um, the um, uh, creation. So yep, everything is now fully connected. Yep. See, look, everything's now fully connected. I know. Oh, nice, right? Yep. See, look, here's a literal proof view that everything's now connected. Yep, there you go. That's your proof. Everything is connected now. See, so yeah, that's literally all we've done so far. So, yep. Yep, we got everything here. Yep, it's all connected now. So now we can go anywhere. <laughs> Yay! Yep, we can go anywhere now. See, so yep, everything is fully connected to each other, and I love every bit of it. I've done a lot in this world, and of course, more to come. Now we gotta start creating the Legos Island stuff uh, here on um, the Creations World. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. Remember to like and subscribe, and I We'll see you guys later on Lagos Island. See how to stay. Party 2020, which I'm literally going to go upload right now. Well, no, 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 no. I'm going to go make that right now. I'm literally going to go onto Lagos Island and create that right now.
So, I'll see all of you guys later for that. You know, if it doesn't take me hours. And you know what? Let me just make the luck effect a full on thing. There we go. All done. Alright. <laughs> For real though, that is it.